Bruno Fernandes scores late to beat Fulham and relieve pressure on Eric Ten Hag. Match winner Bruno Fernandes admitted Manchester United's 1-0 win over Fulham came as a much-needed confidence boost, as his late goal settled a tight contest against Craven Cottage on Saturday. It seemed that United were on the verge of dropping points for the sixth time in 11 Premier League matches after another poor performance in West London. But Fernandez's directed effort from the edge of the penalty area had too much force for Bernd Leno and he found a 91st-minute corner kick to ease the pressure on his coach Eric Ten Hag. The 1-0 win lifted United to sixth place and five points away from the top four. The team faces another decisive match away from home against Copenhagen in the Champions League in midweek. Fernandez said, Everyone knows that the situation is not the best. We lost the last two matches and it was not about the performances we wanted to make or the results, but today was a different match. We had to do something different and we did. We got the three points and that is the most important thing. It's about the team and what everyone does on the pitch. Everyone has to sacrifice, run and work harder. Even when the goal is scored, you can see everyone working hard to get the ball and that's what makes the goal. It was a good performance. We could have created more chances but we still had good chances. In the first half, we controlled the game, the second half was pretty divided but I think the bigger chances were always in our favor and I think we were capable of that. He deserved to win. He added, we must build confidence but we have to understand that we can still do more. We understand now that it is about getting results every time we play. The Champions League is important for us to get the three points. A difficult match away from home this week, but we are Manchester United and we have to win every match. The visitors scored the ball into the net after only seven minutes. Scott McTominay has been a good source of goals for Ten Hag as the club's forwards continue to struggle. The Scottish midfielder converted Alejandro Garnacho's cross but Harry Maguire slightly offside tried to play the ball in before it reached Garnacho, and the goal was disallowed after a lengthy VAR review. After that hot spot, United continued to struggle in attacking areas. Winger Anthony is hooked after another anonymous performance, and the wait for striker Rasmus Hoagland to score a first Premier League goal continues. Fortunately for them, Fulham have also struggled to score goals since Alexander Mitrovic left for Al Hilal. The Cottagers scored just nine goals in 11 games, and were left to room missed chances in a strong spell early in the second half. Andre Onana was moved through by Harry Wilson and Joao Palenia, while Willian fired another good shot wide. United looked headed for a first draw since April until Fulham collapsed in stoppage time. Bolinha twice failed to clear the ball and the ball eventually spread to his fellow Portuguese international. Fernandes was one of the targets of criticism in a disastrous start to the season for United, but he came home a vital winner. She hopes it will be a turning point.